Oh, she's so fluorescent, she blended in with the deck, the, the <laughs> wall for a second. Good afternoon. We're so, We're so glad, glad you're, you're here. here. We, we daily vlog. Sorry, ladies, buddy. Come back tomorrow. And the next day, and the next day. Yes. I'm about to have a spoonful of peanut butter. I just had some. It's been quite a crazy day for me at work, like my Mondays typically are, and I just realized something that is a bittersweet thing, mostly bitter, but also sweet because we're optimistic people. What? I have to stay up very late, I think. Why is that thing? It's There's some, that thing. something that happened with that thing that I have to see it until it's done. But we got some things today in the mail and whatnot mm. that mm. we can't wait to show you. We've had reputation on. Well, my friend Callie just shared with me that the full Waitress the Musical with Colleen Ballinger is on YouTube. It's been up a week. It probably won't be up much longer. Um, but we're going to watch it. Look what my fancy mudda made for us. She made us some Cubs and Disney and winter themed masks for when we go out. What are the Disney ones? What? What's the Disney about them? There's Mickey Mouse on this one. You didn't see that? Oh! Yeah, it's a Mickey, it's Mickey Cubs and then Cubs Christmas. Pretty much our favorite things. Cute! Hi, happy kids. Something happened today. Something great happened today. We found one. And we got it. <laughs> and Mario Kart. And we got Nintendo Online, and oh, my life's gonna change. It's got some old school games in there. I'm more excited about the old school games than Mario Kart and some of the other things. And you didn't even know that. I didn't even know. Yeah. Let's open this bad boy up. All right, so we got here the red and blue Joy-Con Nintendo Switch. Ooh. I can't wait. I can't wait. I hope it, I hope it comes charged already because Sarah's watching this here, here thing. Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, how do these work? I think they slide in. Ooh, it clicks. It clicks. It clicks. Where's the on? I found the on. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, it sounds so cute. Okay, I'm gonna set it up and I'll show you after. So the thing is, is that was definitely not legally recorded. I don't know how long, how it was on YouTube for a week with 84,000 views, but literally as we were watching it, it got pulled. The, this video is no longer available because the YouTube account associated with this video has been terminated. Oh! Don't break the rules, people! Alright, I played Super Mario World on Super Nintendo, and I played Mario Kart 4 races, and now we're cooking dinner. I was explaining to Sarah that it's like a whole different world for me, because last time I like played video games like I don't count playing Call of Duty with Grant when we're in Chicago because it's like fun trip stuff but like what did you trip oh trip I'm just dancing oh <laughs> um last time I played like video games and like had a video game system I played avidly like was we was we but it was like in a point in my life where like it was like all consuming or like I didn't need to balance it with much of anything else and now I've got like a lot of stuff going on like you know <laughs> A wonderful best friend and wife who's pregnant with our baby and a dog who needs me and runs I have to go on and theme parks I have to go play in. So it's going to be weird to like, vlog. in a vlog, and it's just going to be weird to like, n have this game system and console that changes and we buy things for and we play with it and just like not be all consuming. It's cool. So they're making some fajita pasta. I saw a girl on Instagram make it. Insta famous food. So Sarah's gonna ad hoc it. I have uh, two red peppers, a green pepper, and an onion. Um, cooking up with some olive oil, a little bit of vegetable stock, 
And then once the onions are translucent, I'm gonna add in the seasonings, um, and then the oat milk and the pasta, and the pasta's gonna cook right inside it. That is some steamy pasta. I just added some pepper. Sarah's been <laughs> sneezing, sneezing for like five minutes straight now. <laughs> Oh, we decided delicious. to add the vegan cheese after. Just in case it gets liquidy. Yeah. Because a lot of fake cheeses are oily based. We're not fans of it. it smells cheesy. Is that enough? Yeah. There is the finished product that definitely looks like fake cheese. It melts pretty quickly as you can see, but it looks delicious, smells delicious. Did you see what movie I put on? What did you just pop in your mouth? A tomato. Oh, I put on the help. What is your top five favorite movies? Because for both of us, The Help is definitely one of the top five. It's what real life. Oh, you're gonna do it right now. About time. The Help. Uh, Little Women. One more. Ferris Bueller's Day. Ah, I love it. The dinner was delicious. I think you liked it more than me. I did like it, but I think the fake cheese creeped me out a little bit. The thing about Sarah is I often like food more than Sarah. Yeah, and I don't have as big of an appetite right now. Well, then it's because Sarah gets creeped out by stuff. I get so creeped out. Like, she can have, like, one little stringy piece of pepper, like green pepper, in her food, and it would ruin the whole dish. <laughs> because she'd be like, she'd I'm like... I'm not picky, but you're just, not, like, but you get creeped things. out. Yeah. And like, then you won't, it. Then you won't like it for, like, a long time. <laughs> yeah. So that's... Well, we got that's... leftovers, and I'm not going to put in the fake cheese when I eat it tomorrow. But it was good... I want it to be a little bit spunkier. Our, we used oat milk. I'll put the recipe below. We used oat milk and it had a little sweetness to it, which I'm not a fan of like sweet and savory, but um, if I put like a little bit more hot sauce in it for our leftovers. Spicy. That'd be good. I think we're gonna end up playing some Mario Kart later. Sarah hasn't played with the Switch at all. I played with it for a little bit. No. Um, I kind of forgot about it. <laughs> and, but we are in the middle of this movie. But. Yeah. It's my off day from running. Hmm? It's my off day. Oh, I forgot about that. The movie went off prematurely. Well, we'll go back to it, finish it maybe. We're gonna hook up our Nintendo Switch to the TV for the first time. We haven't played, we played on one of these once at the Bugs before. Can I be blue? Because I'm wearing blue shorts and then you can be reddish because you're kind of wearing an orange shirt. Yeah. Look at how cool Sarah thinks she is with her little remote. It's cold in here. We're about to play some, some Mario Kart. I'm Link. Sarah's going to be Toad, it looks like. Um. He's very confused with the noises. <laughs> She's like... All right, we're three races in. Sarah's doing pretty well. Where the shy guy falls. Hurts. Oh, it's the final race. It's the fourth one. Oh, I'm just behind you overall. That was that was the last one. Sarah got me <laughs> in know. the last one. And that actually, I did get you. I don't know what it's called, but it was a green shell. Yeah, you got me halfway through. I the didn't last know you lap. were in first. I was in first, and I would have won overall. I don't control who gets hit <laughs> <laughs> or which one I get in the little secret surprise box. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> we got a piece of we have to see the finish line real because I drifted into it. <laughs> you beat me. I got 15 coins. Highlight reel. I wish you could save them. Look at my little smile. Wait, watch, I wonder if it's gonna if it's gonna cut away before I, I try to kick you. <laughs> I just missed you. <laughs> I'm like, dang it. <laughs> Uh, it's when I just drift. <laughs> you drift the whole time. I do. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Wait, Ooh, you were covered in ink. Did you see that? Yeah, I got you with the thing when I was covered in ink. Oh! 
<laughs> Got me again. <laughs> Did you see my happy face? Oh, there's the finish line. Toad, first place. War, war. Drip. <laughs> All right, Sarah's been chit-chatting with her family. I've been playing Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. It's my favorite game of all time. I'm also starting to work because I actually have to like stay up late and make this thing happen, make sure this thing happens for work before everybody starts working tomorrow. Something got messed up on one of our databases and I have to fix it. It's gonna take hours, but I can't do it till later. So I can start that process now. So it'll probably be a late night for me. Or like doing stuff and sitting and making sure it works, doing stuff, sitting and making sure it works. So it works out that I have this because at some point Sarah's gonna fall asleep. Eve already has fallen asleep I never on the ground. Fall asleep. <laughs> I feel like I haven't been in the sign off. In weeks. Half, no, I was in it two nights ago, but like I feel like I'm in the sign off like half the time these days. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's two of us, so it's great. But you're typically in it too when I'm in it. Oh. All I'm saying is 16-bit games sometimes were the most dramatic things in the whole world. We also wanted to show you what our friends Kayla and Karen got us, or sent us. This is going in our car immediately, the Trans-Siberian Orchestra of the Lost Christmas Eve. And then these two books, How Will You Measure Your Life? Peter, I think. This is for Peter, but we might both read it. And then this is Kayla's copy of Charlotte's Web, and now our kids We'll get to read this special book. We love Charlotte's Web. Also, this sweet rock, her sweet pea, little hidden Mickey on it. So cute. Karen also did some oil blends for us. One for nausea, a peppermint one, which is really helpful for my migraines, um, a puppy, like, relaxing one, which is nice because Eve is so afraid of our lavender bottle now so maybe a I mean I'm sure it probably has lavender in it but maybe something new for her um, switch things up and then a running one um, was there any what other ones were there I don't know. fatigue there was a fatigue one. oh yeah there was a fatigue one yeah I think I think that sounds about right so that was such a nice like sweet little care package from them girls we were supposed to see them super soon and it's sad we probably won't see them until august um but it'll be worth the wait we love those two girls he was asleep but woke up and now it's been a little naughty so i'm gonna bring her into the room and see if we can both go to bed it's april 6th it's not the size of the dog in the fight, but it's the size of the fight in the dog, Mark Twain. Good night from me. Let's hope his sign off isn't too far away. It is 2.40 in the morning, but I am finally going to bed. I actually have to get up in like four and a half, four hours, four and a half hours to finish the process, but I can't do it right now because I have to wait for our systems to update. Um, on the back end, which should happen in about an hour and a half or two, and then I'll finish the process in the morning. Um, but the hard bulk of it is over. Um, thank you guys for following along with us. I know it was a pretty um, just relaxed day with the unboxing of all the gifts and the Nintendo Switch and everything. Um, but tomorrow is another day, and we're hearing good things, well, bittersweet things today. Um, cultural representatives got sent home, but then they're saying that Florida might peak a few weeks earlier than expected. All the good news is good news. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>